Hello, my freedom lovers and my fellow Americans. Uh, this, let me introduce to you, if you don't know this gentleman here, it's Pastor James David Manning. Now, the establishment really don't like this gentleman because uh, they can't uh, play the race card off him. It's very obvious why, you can see here. But this man is, is trying to uh, shine the light on a uh, major conspiracy that's been ongoing in this country for quite some time. And uh, I'm going to brush real briefly here. This video is going to be about what he's doing right now as we speak. Uh, it's about the eligibility of the 44th President of the United States that was elected here in 2008. And uh, uh, there's a lot of evidence out there pointing that he is not a natural born citizen. The key words here is natural born citizen, not U.S. citizen. Because the Constitution demands a natural born citizen, not U.S. citizen. Most people don't know that, but that's what it actually stipulates and demands. So, what we're going to show here is a video of uh, right outside his, his uh, church. He's having a trial. Yes, it is a real trial. He's having real judges, real jury selection. It's during the jury selection that he's doing here, which you're going to see the first day, which is uh, May 14th, 2010. Uh, this is just the beginning here. There will be more to follow up, I'm sure. But uh, this is uh, what happens when some of the people that are coming and how they're being uh, attacked by the, the locals that are protecting this uh, criminal that is taking the office and uh, wrongfully in place and why they fear this trial and actually why they fear it, there's many reasons uh, but uh, you'll see the tactics they use and stuff and uh, basically we're going to shift right on over to that and uh, head to the video here I want to show it and uh, we'll get it rocking and rolling and Yo, so you just mad this is a black man. What? I, I you just mad this is a black man. man. He's, he's a young man. He's a young man. He's a young man in foster ball. And he's a black man. And you're never going to do that thing right. Just step on up. Excuse me, what? You know what? Yes, his father was white. His mother was white and his father was black. And he was born. Okay. Yep. See, so she's being corrected here now. I want you to notice this sign here, say the Constitution. This is a very key part here, okay? We're going to let it roll. She didn't care if he's communist. So he's oh, you're a brother. You're a brother. Yes, he was. There's no proof of it. Tell me. Online. Tell me. Look, look, look. Can't see what I'm saying. 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 Look, look, look. Can't see what I'm
calling. A lot of credibility there, huh? Constitution is divisive now. All the hate in her, in her eyes here. What do they fear? Okay. That sign says it all. You hear what she said, her own words there. The save the Constitution is racist. It, she, she's threatened by liberty and freedom, by, by being self-reliance, by being independent, an individual. She's threatened, and that's what she's really angry about. She, she wants big government to provide for her and to take care of her. And, and and everybody else should live the same life as she has. That's what she believes in. And see, she's attacking these God-fearing patriots with name-calling, nothing back in her, her position whatsoever, and it's very clear. Just go ahead, put some comments down below here. Uh, I want to just chat about this debate and... and that's my opinion. I guess that's how I see it very clear. I mean, these people here, if it's true that he is legitimate in the office, he is. But I don't believe he is, myself, personally. So, but go ahead, leave a comment, and uh, look, we'll, we'll look forward to it. All right.